levels on levels on levels I am, but yeah, yo, thinking y'all better. I ain't fucking with these haters right now, they just hang on my neck like a shackle. Trying to drag me down into the dirt like a dog, I ain't trying to. Alright, morning guys. So, unfortunately, I will not be going to the athlete meetup today. I'm actually absolutely gutted about it, but, you know, I have prior commitments for work. Don't finish there till about maybe 6, half 6, possibly 7, depending. So, I think it'll be a good one. I'm gonna capture all this on the vlog. Hope you guys enjoy it. What is up guys, today is the day of the Alphalete meetup. Um, as I say, I said earlier on in the vlog, he's unfortunately not going to be able to go. So I'm going to try to make sure that I have as much fun as I can for him. But um, like that's not the reason why I even brought the camera right now. When we first started vlogging, our initial, like our goal is to give you a very practical view and very practical takeaways. But it was also to tell you the true story of our own journey personally. And um, that's physically, that's in relation to the business as well. And like, I just haven't been completely honest. And I know I haven't. And I know how difficult it is to be honest on, you know, Instagram is a highlight reel. Everyone shows the best stuff. YouTube is a highlight reel. Everyone shows the best stuff. Facebook is a highlight reel. They're all highlight reels. And it's very, it's very difficult to open up on any platform. But um, like just in relation to where I believe I am, I feel like I've got so much catching up to do to like to everybody. I feel like I'm at the very bottom rung of that ladder in terms of my, you know, my physical physical goals in terms of my actual physique in terms of, um, in terms of my fitness knowledge. I just, in terms of my personal brand, I just feel like all of those things are just right, like right at the bottom, and it's like an internal str it's like a struggle, but um. I'm not bringing it up to be like negative and stuff because like I do love the struggle and I do love the idea of I suppose being an underdog or you know starting off at the bottom and just trying to grind and grind to make your way up to the top and I think what's sparking this discussion is the fact that Christian Guzman from Alpha Lead is going to be here today and honestly it's like seeing his journey and seeing his story inspired myself to you know, bring up the idea of Break Beyond, to bring up the idea of creating a brand that represented the everyday athlete. Just like seeing that journey and seeing the kind of grind that he went through, the kind of, you know, like, I do know that there were like differences in that he had like a huge following um, before he even started. So like creating a brand from a huge following, I can assume like wouldn't be as difficult as creating a brand from scratch. But then I see the likes of Ben Francis who did it. I see, the likes of like Stephen Bartlett who created a social media company from nothing as well and I I just want like that's that's what I want and I want it so badly like I'm like I'm kind of obsessed with that and I think obsession is good I really do but at the same time I feel like obsession can push people away and it can push team members away because you're always pushing people harder and I know PJ is very resilient. I'm always pushing PJ every single day, even though like, and to be honest, like, like we've had our fallouts in terms of like task completion. Isaiah, I'm always pushing him harder. And sometimes I feel like I can see the effect that it has on him, but like he's very resilient as well. So while I do appreciate this obsession that I have with this, I do have to realize that not everyone can be pushed to the same extent or not everyone can be continuously told, oh, you know, be better or Guys, I don't know what I'm rambling on about. All I know is that I want to start being more honest with you, show you the inside thoughts, what I think in my brain. And yeah, I also barely slept last night just because I was brainstorming ideas for Facebook groups. So that's it, that's me. Let's see what's going on in the Alpha Lead headquarters. Well, you know, Rob Lipsitz hosting the event. So see you there. I'm too into the fitness game. I was gonna say smart. <laughs> She's so nice to me, so I'm surprised. Like, what's this guy talking about, yeah? So then um, she ends up giving me just new earphones here, and you're telling me she's racist. Bro, come on, it's only one sushi place. At least there's still sushi. No. It's only the place. There's still sushi place. in the world, man. Oh, there's still sushi, man. Get off me. No. You're hurting me. <laughs> <laughs> they did sushi so, sumo sundays. So all you can eat is sushi for 20 euro. Yeah. On Sunday. No, you can get a better deal. Don't worry, don't worry. We'll find one. Come on.
Dimitro thinks that the second he puts that drone up, all of the lads. No, we won't say the second. Well, okay. We'll give it a minute. Okay, a minute. Okay. Bye. These lads agree with Dimitro. What's your name, bro? Zach. Zach. Alex. And Alex. Yeah, Alex. Yeah, fair play, lads. You're about to be. You're about to be stumped today, lads. Look, they're actually in unison. Look at their pose. It's perfect. <laughs> the elbow, everything. It's perfect. Man. Did you guys planned this. You knew we were coming. Let's do this. Let's do this, man. Let's eat all the chicken nuggets today. Mm, I already ate mine. It's been a minute, lads. I don't see no one. No one, man. No, they. They, they didn't even fucking. Shut up, Dimitro. Fucking man. Look at this. PJ's taking up all the boys. Go on, PJ. Oh. <laughs> this is Victor and Mizi right here. Uh, you've probably seen them some of the breakdown photos. And uh, you know what? I'd just like to say, just a really nice guy, honestly. He's, you know, he's, he's doing his own YouTube thing, but at the same time, you know, he's trying to help a brother out. You know what I mean? So um, I, think, I think in the, in the future, um, if he keeps going the way he's going, yeah, he could blow. Uh, you heard it here first, yeah? It's, it's, not, you know, it's not really it's not, it's not even a long thing. But don't worry, in the long term, <laughs> it's going to be coming along soon. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you already know about the old one fix one and I will put Manchester on the go. Wait. Alright, so we are in Raw Gym Sandyford. Currently waiting in line to meet Christian Guzman and Student Aesthetics, Emily Hayden and Rob Lipsy. Alright, we're pretty much here right now, so photo time. Finished up meeting all of the lads. Um, honestly, it was just it was so good. Nice, so nice to be here. So nice to meet all of these different people over here. All support Christian Guzman and Alphili. Um Yeah, guys. I know some of you might be watching from the actual meet because I did exchange a few names with a few people. So if this is your first time to the channel, just stay in store. All right, there's gonna be a lot coming up, and I'm gonna make this a really exciting journey for all of you. That's it for me, guys. Gonna end the vlog over here. As always, break beyond. That's the meet up, how was everything? So, it wasn't planned, but some of the stuff that happened, you would think that it was planned. We met so many cool people. Met up with people that, um, that I haven't seen for years. So, um, yeah, all together, we met Christian Guzman, met so many cool people, and just to round it all up, I'm just happy with everything that happened today. Boom. Break beyond. Boom, baby. <laughs> it, it, is, it isn't a close and outro, PJ. I don't oh. need you to close this Okay, plug. okay, sorry, sorry. Okay, look, this is what happened, man. Yeah, you should have told me that. I told you that. I was even doing my, my daddy talk. Hey, you know, uh, you know me. Okay, so guys, this is what happened, yeah. So, Christian Guzman thinking he's all big in that, you know. I squared up to him. I was like, look, let's take a quick photo. Just so you know, I can act like I actually care. I took a photo with him. I uh, know I do care about Christian Guzman. He's a good guy. Big muscles. Yeah, can I just shout out a, pe a few people? Uh, shout out to Brandon. Uh, today, cool guy. Very, very cool. Cool guy. Um, who else was there? Victor Amizi. Victor Amizi. Um, Liam Cannon. Liam Cannon. Cool, very, cool very guy. Cool, cool guy. Uh, Dimitro. Thank Dimitro, you for showing up as well. Thank you so much. Um, shout out to Christian. Christian Guzman, Rob Lipsy, uh, uh, Emily Hayden, uh, Student Aesthetics. Yeah. It was a good day, guys. Honestly, it was just. And, uh, it's really good. This, this is my brother right here, man. Just gonna say that to you guys. Yeah. Find someone. That motivates you, that's what I'm gonna say. Yeah. And Find someone that entertains you and motivates you. Yeah, yeah man. But mostly entertain. I'm just joking. <laughs> <laughs> is that all I am to you, man? That's all I am to you. I'm okay with that. <laughs> hey. hey, I got a purpose. <laughs> uh, that's the same thing my mom said to me, though. What? Like, PJ, you know, though, if you weren't funny, I'll slap you right now. <laughs> <laughs> no.